Other news now, a Windham music teacher has not only been nominated for a Grammy, but has made it to the quarterfinals. Jared Cassidy is the only teacher in New Hampshire to be included in the group. The award is for music educators who've made a remarkable impact on students. And as Heather Hamill reports, Cassidy says if it wasn't for them and his colleagues, he wouldn't be where he is. <laughs> Jared Cassidy's love of music has always driven him, and combined with his commitment to teaching, it's earned him a special honor, a Grammy nomination. I think that this award symbolizes outstanding musical achievement in, in music educators and in music programs, but moreover, this is an award that would really, that's really focused on Wyndham. It's a matter of maintaining that funnel, if you will. Here we go. Let's play the first chord of Symphonia. Cassidy is entering his 10th year of teaching at Windham High School. The 32-year-old says the students, teachers, and community have shaped him, and they deserve the accolades. But after a student and his mother nominated him for the Music Educator of the Year Award, he found himself getting recognition. And what started out as more than 7,000 nominees nationwide has now dropped down to 220, and he's still in the running. I've been trying really hard to kind of stay grounded, and I want to focus on the new school year coming up and my students, of course, and everything, but um, it's definitely an exciting time. Cassidy is not only the director of bands for the high school, but this year was promoted to the fine arts director for the entire district. He prides himself on being a likable teacher, but also a tough one, emphasizing the need for collaboration. We are constantly having discussions about how the music is sound. It's not me up on the podium saying, I want it this way, I want it that way. It's very much um, student, student guided. Lecturing is not his goal. Instead, it's hands on and a focus on building relationships with students. My students are not necessarily going to go to school. We know that. They're not going to go to school and all be music majors or professional musicians. Um, but moreover, I want them to leave the program and find passion in what it is that they love. In Windham, Heather Hamill, WMUR News 9. So talented, and he will find out if he made it into the top 10 next month.